Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Fallout London. Now, last time we left off, I believe, assassinating someone who was going to call reinforcements on our um, on our little gang here, so we had to silence them and uh, make sure they didn't do that. So, um, I believe we had to talk to him last time to try to get some jobs around here and see um, see what we could do. So let's go ahead and uh, I guess My figure all that out. Wanted me to be a farmer. Sir Winston said they fished you out some land down the Pinder. If I still had eyes, I'd say you were pulling the wool over him. But Gaunt backed him up, and he's not the fanciful type. Well, pleased to meet you, Wayfarer. My name's Blind Nelson. I'm Sebastian's right-hand man, and I was the same to his father back when he was the boss of the Vagabonds. I can't see no more, but I've been round the houses far longer than anyone else here, and my brain still ticks as good as ever. Uh... Well, I don't like to be disrespectful, so you're a commuter, Nelson? Well, check out the eyes on this one. Yeah, there's a bunch of us commuters about. Something to do with radiation and whatnot. I never much cared why. I lost my skin to it back when I was young, and I've stayed like this ever since. You get used to it. There are some what call us ghouls. Cheeky bastards. Um, is there work that needs doing around here? Feel free to ask around. We're always short-handed here and there. I've got a bit of work for you myself, in fact. Uh, what do you need? Simple fact is, my radio's broke, and I'm lost without it. Sebastian keeps me around for what brains I have, but without my radio, I'm deprived of some very necessary intel. Okay. I need someone with a pair of eyes and a pair of legs to fix it. You fit the bill, right? Here's a broken radio. Go find Chill Winston and ask him if he has any parts to fix it. All right, easy Bulletooth enough. Bulletooth Anthony is a workbench for when you've got the bits. Bring it back here when it's all working smoothly and you're done. Easy, right? Yeah, easy enough. Nobody's getting shot done, never hurt anything. All right. Um, guess I need to talk to you, brother. Hello, mate. Nice to see you again. What can I do you for? Uh, Blind Nelson needs his real fix. You said you have the parts. I'm quartermaster. Oh. I tried to keep no, that's not what I selected. There oh, we go. Hey, let's have a butcher's. Looks like he needs a new antenna. I'll have one in a box somewhere, I'm sure. But look, whilst I'm rooting around for that, I've got a job for you. Okay. One of my main suppliers is running late with a delivery, and she's never late. I'm worried something's gone wrong. But after the latest attack here, I can't leave my post to see. I want you to nip down to Nadia's on Deptford Ice Street to check in on things, and get me the package if it's ready. By the okay. time you're back, I'll have the antenna for you. I mean, I guess that's fine. I guess I can go do that. All right, so I guess we are heading on out. Okay. All right. We got to go figure out what was going on. So it looks like it is this way, based on the marker. We can keep an eye on that. Um... Maybe we can cut through here, let's see. I cannot jump, okay, there we go. So we have the Churchill Library. I guess I can cut through here, maybe? Yes, this way. look like it is the targets that I'm looking for or general area I guess uh, I guess I probably need to check my armor as well just to make sure everything is all good so okay that seems okay Gonna let him up. Yeah. 
Nice. Let me get some better stuff on me real quick. Um, let's get rid of those. Uh, nice. Okay. We have slightly better armor. That's good. This is very good. Okay. So I guess we're supposed to talk to you. Excuse me. Hello. Hello. I guess I have you to thank. Those hooligans were ruining my lovely shop. <laughs> what a mess. What a mess. Can you stop walking? There we go. Uh, he says the supplies are Oh, yes, right. yes. <laughs> Good old vagabonds looking after us measly shopkeepers. Us poor lowly dealers subject to the whims and terrors of fate. We're very grateful, we are. Well, well, <laughs> I have that Winston fellow's package here. Take it to him, will ya? My usual runner got scared off and now I've got some clear up to do. But okay. listen here, I am grateful to you for helping out. You need some supplies? I will give you the best prices. Okay. All ethically sourced, of course. Alright, easy enough. Alright, so I guess I gotta go back and speak with uh, Winston, and I guess we will be all squared away. Alright, here we go. You got the delivery then? Thanks for that. And I'm glad Nadia's okay. She's one of my sharpest suppliers. I found the path for the radio you were after. Here you are. If you need a workbench to fix it, check with Bullet Tooth Anthony. It's usually down the basement. All right. Down the basement we go, I guess. Um. If you hang around, wouldn't hurt none. We need the numbers. All right, sir. I need to talk to you. Hello, sunshine. The name's Bullet Tooth Anthony. What you after? Um, I need to repair a radio. Can I use no your workbench? No chance, sunshine. I'm trying to fix up an old laser rifle I found, and it's laid out in a hundred pieces right now. You dare mess that up, and I'll have your head off. Come on, but dude. Look, you find me a piece to replace an old crystalline photon agitator, and I'll be able to finish it off. Then the workbench is all yours. I guess that's fair. Um... Where can I find this magic Most crystal? Most messes of old scrap electronics will have something useful in them. You can generally salvage them in old supply stores, or some of the traders in Lewisham should sell them. Okay, find a crystal on photon agitator. My mother wanted me to be a farmer. I get my hands dirty in other ways. Okay, I guess that's fine then. Um, all right, guess we'll go try to find what we need to get. All right, so where do I need to go for this? Just down this way again? Uh, back in Bromley, I guess. Okay. Uh, I think I am pretty much out of ammo on that. So let's... Um, oh, those are pretty much the same thing. Okay. We'll ignore that. Um... We can work with that, I guess, since it does 25 damage. It's a little slow, but it's all good. Alright, so I'm assuming we're supposed to probably go invade some kind of parts store, right? Is, I think, what we're doing. Um, so let's go do that. The AP in this is definitely rough, for sure. Okay, so, okay yeah, so I guess I need to look around in here. Oh, I thought someone was walking up on me. Okay. So, okay, what exactly is it that I'm looking for then? Just electronics? It's a photon agitator, right? Oh. There we go. Easy enough. Honestly, I thought I was going to have to do a bunch of scrapping and whatnot for, for that. But hey, you know, um, we take it. We take those. All right. Let's head on down and give that photon agitator over and we should hopefully be able to use the workbench after that point so let's see 
where is where is he? There we are. Okay. Hello again, sunshine. What you after? Uh, I got it. Ah, lovely jubbly. Give it here, and I can get it cleared up. Here we are, a fully restored Upton Burke Class C laser rifle. Ain't it a beaut? Absolute shite that keeps breaking after ten shots, mind. But it'll bugger up anything it hits before then. Now, you had some gizmo you wanted patched up. And it here, and I'll sort it for you. Everything for a damn radio. Let's see. Out with the old, in with the new. I can tidy these frayed wires, too. This is quite the old bit of junk Nelson's hanging on to. Well, it's all fixed. But it looks like the battery is knackered. I've got none of the right sort here, but Johnny Shrapnel should have him in spades. He's usually hanging out back by the chem station. More bodies get right. shite done, never hurt anything. Yeah, please don't tell me you're gonna send me on another damn fetch quest. Ah, uh, come on. I just wanna be I just want the stand radio to be done, man. Oi oi, if it ain't that lab rat, the fuck you want? Need to find a battery. Could help, sure. But I've got my own problems God to worry about. Listen, give me an hand with something delicate and I'll see what I can sort for you. Mickey's been having a barney at me for blowing up his hat. And yes, yes, I did blow up his hat. And don't you mind how or why. But at the end of the day, it's just some damn cloth. Right? Well, fancy pants Mickey don't see it that way. And I can't keep going on with him giving me the evil eye all day. He's freaking me the fuck out. So I found him something to make up for things. But if I go trying to give it to him myself, I just know I'll say something stupid and ruin it. Why don't you go have a go at delivering it for me? Make him accept the damned apology and I can sort you out with a new battery. My mother wanted me to be a father. All right, I but guess. Let's see, place. where is he? Guess I'll give that little package over to you. What's up, Mickey? Hello, Gov. My name's Mickey. Can I help you with something? So that shrapnel brain pillock thinks he can just fund me with some token. That was my favorite hat he ruined. Tell him to fuck off. I got 20 tickets, I guess, why not? Well, it's not just about the value, you see. Ah, oh, fuck it, fine. I can't seriously stain that of that idiot for long. Thanks. Until they let it, he's forgiven. All right, easy enough. The things you can do with money, very cool. If you hang around, wouldn't hurt none. Hey, we need the you get Mickey to take the gift. Smashing. I wasn't sure how that would go. I'm glad he didn't try to kill you. Yeah, now, thank you God. You wanted a battery for that radio. Give it here, and I'll see what I've got. Blimey, this is old. Where do you even get something as tonty as this? I'll have to wire up a couple of nine volts to get this to work. Let's see. Here you go. All done. And thanks once more for your help with Mickey. All right. Thank God. I get to finally return this old ass radio. God damn. getting shite done. Never hurt anything. You got the radio done up? I do. You took your damn time about it. Where'd you go to fix it? As a buy on? Well, better late than never, I guess. Cheers. Don't know what I'd do without this. Now. Let's have a listen to what's happening out in the smoke. Um. Okay, guess we're just gonna follow how long with him in a cutscene, I guess. Make sure you're all on high alert. The execution of the vagabond prisoner will take place in Indiskin Square in Millwall. We're expecting a massive crowd, so we need all hands on deck. If you're IODS in Millwall, be there. We're gonna send a message to these two-bit punks. Nobody bombs a syndicate train station and gets away with it. Oh, for fuck's sake, turn that damn thing off! Why'd you even bring me this stupid radio anyway? You were just trying to upset me, weren't you? What? Where's Yvette? She's the one who vouched for you. I'm gonna give her a piece of my mind. Brother, what? You must have been listening in the next room before you brought it over here. 
How else would that news have been so perfectly timed? I'm on to you, Lebret. You fucking kidding me, brother? Oh shit, that's right. God damn it! Oh, I know exactly where she went. She's got ties to Millwall. No doubt she's there now, about to find herself knee-deep in shit. Hey, listen, mate. Sorry I lost it on you a second ago. Y you did good with the radio. Well, you I need you to do something else for me now. Uh, okay. Something much more important. All right. Um, what kind a of job? rescue of sorts. I need you to go to Millwall and make sure Yvette hasn't done anything too stupid. And if she has, I need you to unfuck the situation. Easy enough. She's got roots there. And you don't need to be Sherlock fucking Holmes to figure out she's going to make sure that poor soul headed to the hangman isn't one of her people. Bring Yvette back in one piece and I'll make it worth your while. All right. Brilliant. Head north to Millwall and don't come back until you find Yvette. Tell her blind Nelson's looking for her. The fastest route across the Thames is through the Greenwich foot tunnel. All right. I guess I will be heading out around, that way. Oh, is there... Oh, is there two different doors? Interesting. All right. So, let's see. Looks like it is right over here. So, let's see. Do we have... Board? Yes, we do. Okay. Looks like we need to go, I guess, around here. I'll just take the tickets, I guess, that random bug had. Very nice. I always could use a little money. I guess we've got through here. See if there's anything on our way. Good. Always good. Seems like stuff has been happening here. Okay. Okay, guess we're gonna head on in and see what happens. Okay, let's see. What are we dealing with? Oh, is this not where we're supposed to go? What? Um, I mean, I, well, hang on. Not sure this must be where we go, yeah? Hmm. Trying to get the feeling maybe it's not. Interesting. Let me just double check, right? Okay, no, we definitely need to go down here, that's for sure. I think this is the only way across. Was not expecting this. Let's do that. We will eat all of you.
Alright, this has to be the way to go, yeah? Also, I don't know what I'm supposed to do. What? How do I... How do I cure this? Oh yeah, I can level up. I totally forgot about that. So what do we want to do? Pickpocket, nah, slayer, speed of all melee, and unarmed. Yep, that could be good. Rooted. No, basher, I'm bashing, sippy aim. Coming back, heavy gunner. Armor, big leagues. Probably Slayer would be good then, yeah? That seems like the right way to go. Okay. All right. Oh, what the hell? What the fuck? Wait, what the fuck is going on? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Um... Oh shit. Damn bro, Fallout London is like a whole horror game. What the fuck? Man, I need to get the fuck out of here. Holy shit. Go ahead and take the Oh, herbs. my head. I feel like my eyes are being pushed out of my skull. Do I have anything I can take to increase perception? Or I do this. Perception 2, I could maybe take that. Okay, let me see, I guess, what happens with that. My mother wanted me to be- Oh, hello, stranger. How wonderful to meet you. Lovely day, isn't it? Sounds good. Well, um... I don't know, what do I do exactly? Because I'm supposed to meet her, but I don't want to die, you know, like... 
chattiest chuffer in the churchyard. What on earth could you want now? Have you been to the pub? Nah, it's Sounds members good. only. The password is. Alright, I'm just gonna save. Before we do anything else. crazy. Well, aren't you the chattiest chuffer in the churchyard? What on earth could you want now? I'm sorry, mate. I think. I've never heard of. Huh? Hey! We got intruders over here! Sound the alarm! Damn. You umber. Come here, you donut. <laughs> God, how do I do this? God, I need to get out of here somehow. Fuck. Um. I guess it's this way. Wait, hang on. Is that where I'm supposed to be going? Can I just fast travel if I can? Okay. Alright, so I can head on over here and get to the safe house, man. Oh, dude, she's definitely gonna. She's definitely gonna hate us for that, I'm pretty sure. It is what it is, though, I guess. What can you do? Let's see, I guess this will be the safe house. Alright. Alright. Um. What am I supposed to do now? Need what? Uh, um. Okay, so now what? Now what do I do? Um, do I need to go back out? They just left. What the fuck? Okay, so I do I just need to talk to them? Can I help you? Um, I was in train trash and have felt right. Can you help me? I can't say I've treated a survivor of a rail accident before. This'll be interesting. Alright, um, I guess that was there. Easy. He was suffering from some kind of psychological distress, probably brought on by the crash. That remedy should do the trick. Just remember those breathing exercises. All right, affliction curd. There we go. Okay, so what do I, what what do I need to do now? Because meeting at Millwall. So what do I do exactly? You know what I mean? Like I don't. Because I made it to the safe house, but now what? You know. Um. What the, f what the fuck am I supposed to do from here? Do I need to talk to the person, maybe? More bodies get as much as I'd done. love to have a chat, we're kind of escaping at the moment. Well, for the love of God, stay focused! Um. Okay. Um. Do you need medical assistance? No, I'm good, but. Goodbye. I don't. What? I'm so confused, but okay. Um, I guess I will let them be for now. Um, not really sure what I'm supposed to do at this point, but I guess that's okay. We need the numbers. All right. Well, um, I guess I'll go ahead and leave off this episode of Fallout London here. Um, it's been interesting, um, for sure. I'm not really sure what I'm supposed to do with them. I'm assuming they're just going back now. I don't know what I need to 
do specifically. I guess I can probably head back to... I guess Swan and Miter, because I'm assuming that's where they're heading. So I'm a, I guess I'll head back there just in case. All right, so I think I'm going to go ahead and actually leave it off for this episode. I feel like we've done a good amount. Um, I still don't really know what I'm supposed to do from this point with the Dominion of Millwall. It's like, I got to the Vagabond safe house, but now what do I do, you know? So, um, yeah, so I, I cured one of my afflictions, which is good. Um, so I guess I'll have to take a look at the other one and uh, kind of see what exactly I need to do. So... Uh, with that out of the way, ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for watching. This has been Fallout London Episode 2. My name is Digital Kingdom Editor, and I will see y'all in the next one.